Now that you have registered your Smart7 license to your account and downloaded the installer and installed it on your computer, it's time to activate Smart7. The easiest and quickest way to do this is to use the Activate Online Now function. So you open Smart7 on your computer and you're going to get to an activation screen that looks like this. The Activate Online Now function button is right at the top. We highly recommend that you use this whenever possible for a computer that's connected to the internet because it is the quickest, easiest, and most foolproof way to uh, get your license activated. So click on the Activate Online Now button and it's going to ask for your smart license number. In this case, it's got the wrong one. So you can go to your account and you can, or the email or from wherever you have your license number, you simply need to enter the license number and you're going to need to put in the account password for the account that you registered the license to. And you're going to need to put in the name of the person doing this doing the installation. And you're going to need to put in your email address. And then it's going to ask you to give your computer a friendly name so that you can distinguish it from other installations on the same license. At this point, just hit continue. Oh, and you, I'm sorry, you want to also make sure that you check the button here that says this license has already been registered because you have, in fact, already registered to your account. Once you hit the continue button, the uh, program will do all the necessary work in the background to call out across the internet, get all the right codes, and you should see almost instantly a congratulations activation was successful screen. Just click OK and then Smart V7 will start running on your machine and your license is activated and ready to go. Now that we have shown you how to install your license the easy way using the Activate Online Now feature, we're going to show you how to install, uh, activate your license uh, if you happen to be working on a computer that for some reason cannot be connected to the internet. So, it starts off the same as the online activation way. You're going to need to open Smart 7 and at this point you're going to get the same activation screen as you did as if you were using the Activate Online Now feature. At this point, however, you need to uh, find something to write on and you're going to need to write down the machine ID because you're going to need to take this information over to a computer that is connected to the internet. The machine that you're working on doesn't have to be connected, but you at some point have to find a machine that is. You can't do this uh, without getting online somehow. So take your machine ID, jot it down somewhere on a piece of paper, then you're going to need to go find a computer that is in fact connected to the internet, log into your account at my.rationalacoustics.com, click on the software license that you're working with from within your account, and you're going to get to your license management page for that specific license number, and there's a big yellow bar. You need to click on the yellow bar that says register a new installation. At that point, you need to put in your machine ID from the piece of paper that you've written it down on, And then it's going to ask you to give the computer a name. This is, will um, help you distinguish uh, your installation from if you have multiple installations going on. It's going to ask you who, who is doing the installation. And it's going to ask for your email address. Okay, hit submit. At that point, it's going to give you an activation code. You need to then write down that activation code. And then go back to the computer that you're trying to do the smart install that is not connected to the internet. And you're going to enter the activation code into the activation code field here. It's very important that you be careful when you write down these numbers that you don't transpose anything or write in any wrong information because it will not allow you to activate if you make a typo. <laughs> and then you click on the activate installation button. And if all goes well, you'll get the congratulations activation was successful screen. Click OK. And then SMART will 
Finish activation and start running and you'll be good to go. All the information that we've covered in this video can be found in the Smart V7 licensing and installation help file, which can be found several places. A link to it is included in your email receipt, which comes with your license number right below your license number. You can also find it from within your account at my.rationalacoustics on your license page right here as a link. You can also find it on our main commercial website in the V7 support docs and FAQ link. And it's a PDF file, which we highly, highly recommend that everybody read prior to downloading and installing your Smart V7 license.